Hey guys, and welcome back to Resident Evil The Village, where we last left off, we were being chased around by some weird semi-aborted fetus thing, uh, which is fun, you know. Um, but we do have the breaker key now. So, let's try. I'm guessing it's going to be up here somewhere. Because it ain't going to be that easy, Chief. There's no way. There's no way we're just going to walk out of here. Oh, you know, maybe we are. Oh. Uh-oh. Um. Oh, boy. This is going to get worse before it gets better. Yeah, fuck you, baby. Fuck you. Button, button, button. <laughs> Ugh. Look at that thing. Oh, that noise. Oh, that noise. What the fuck was that? That was... <laughs> oh, God, she's having a good time. That was... Pretty fucking gribbly. Alright, you. You've had your fun. Creepy aborted fetus thing. Oh, lots of dolls everywhere. Don't leave. I can't let you. You're still alive. Oh, boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. So we've got to find that creepy ass little doll. Before ev all the others, I guess, kill us. Uh. Oh, hello. Oh, Jesus Christ. Okay. Okay, where the fuck has it gone now? You know, this is a really weird <laughs> Resident Evil game. It's really bizarre. Oh, hello. Come on, stab it again. Really? How many times? How many times? Where are you? Where are you? Oh, there you are. Okay, it's not very hard. Is that right? Oh, shit. Oh, fucking hell. Stupid idiot. What are you doing to my cute friends? That's the hit of the whole fruit. Oh. It's over. I... Make things right. Hang on a minute, Ethan. We don't know what Ethan what? has done yet. Uh, what Mia has done. I need to get out of this place. We don't know what she's done yet. Combined with the four wings key. So that's who was behind all this. Recovered lost belongings. Um. Oh. Okay. Are you sure about that? We right. So where were they? That makes two. 
Right, well, we got our shit back. That was interesting. Um, I, yeah. I guess there was nothing really to find here. Um, I, you know, I don't like... I don't like games where you can't fight back, which is one reason why I've always liked Resident Evil. Um, okay, so I guess there isn't actually any treasure there. And it's why I don't like things like Amnesia, you know. But this this wasn't bad. This was, you know, it was it was a very short, very easy section. So as long as they don't pull that on us again, I'll be happy. Anywho, let's get out of here. I mean, it looks like they blew most of the budget on the castle because if all the other four lords are just going to be little little spats like that, I mean, that's going to be a bit disappointing because the castle bit was pretty damn cool. But anyway, we did it. We're done. That baby was creepy. I would have liked to actually have been able to fight it and put it in the ground. Because I don't like the idea that that thing's still walking around. Or crawling and slothing around, I should say. That's kind of interesting, though. That doll maker, she had um, pretty interesting power. So I guess all the time we were stabbing the doll in the head, we was actually stabbing her in the head. We were just like, uh, it was very obvious that Ethan was hallucinating at that point. So let's try that. Can't use that here. What else do we get? Um, Legs flask. Uh, how? Unless treasure, maybe. Is there anything to examine on this doll? Maybe we have missed something. But we didn't know, did we? Hmm. Do I have to go back down? Unless now can we go and fight that baby now? Surely it's worth a look. Ah, oh, fuck. Uh, before we go, all right, because I've got a save, let me just... Uh, I hate to do this, but let me just do a little bit of research a minute because I don't want to miss any treasures. Okay, so... Unfortunately, we can't go back and fight the baby, but I have looked up without any spoilers um, if we've missed something to pick that up and we have not missed anything to pick it up thus far. So I'm guessing we come back later with uh, something for that. We'll figure it out. Um, but 
yeah, my my concern was we missed something in the house, but we haven't. I looked up everything, uh, every collectible in the house, <laughs> and there was nothing for that. So, right, let's get some bullets, and we now have the key. Where are we now? Ah, oh. God, that's annoying. Urgh. But it's fine. So we're in the garden. Need to keep our ears peeled. Oh, hello. Ooh. Are you zombies? Yeah, I guess so. So I guess zombies are actually a thing. Right, one down. Scratch one. I think they're behind me too. Yes, they are. Right. Oh, you little sausage. Right, scratch two. Come on. Bullets for everyone. Ow. Okay. Oh, God. Come on, dude. Give me your loot. Give me your treasure. That's all I'm here for at the end of the day. I mean, I'm not 100% sure what they are. They're some kind of zombie, but... I like those things. You know, this game definitely has something that Resident Evil 7 sorely lacked, and that's enemy variety. Resident Evil 7, you know, you had mold monsters, you had the fast mold monsters, you had the slow armored mold monsters, um, and then you had the big strong ones, and oh, hello. That was like it, you know? Sun and Moon Ball. Very nice. Okay, so. Landmine, we'll have that. Oh, yes, please. Very nice. Oh, oh my god. Have we got. We've got a new shotgun. We've got a new shotgun. Which is cool. But. That means our old shotgun. Everything we've dumped into that was a huge waste of money. Hmm. <sighs> The W870 tack. So it does uh, examine. So yeah, it does more damage. I wish you could compare. We'll 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 have a look. I might sell the basic shotgun then. Okay. Okay. I can't hear any chattering. Any of those wooden lads. So what's this way? Oh. Did those things come out of the graves? If they did... That's really freaking cool. I like that. Yep. No, can't hear any uh, dingly dangly lads, so... I'm guessing thus far... There's been nothing to hunt. Okay. Oh, we're in one of the graves. Dig your own grave and save. 
Right, okay. Oh, we've got to go right round. Of course we have. Have we? Oh, fuck me. That actually made me jump. Holy fucking hell. That actually made me jump. Come on, lad. You get a prize. Your prize is I'm going to end your suffering. I can't believe he made me jump. Oh, hello. Yeah, can't believe he made me jump. Jesus Christ. I'm always impressed when that happens. Because, you know, you think you've killed all the enemies. And there's one sneaky little fucker left. Oh. Oh. It's so exciting in this game when you find somewhere that you haven't looted yet. Yeah, we'll check that out in a minute. And where is Ethan keeping... Oh! Where is Ethan keeping all of this stuff? Uh, okay. My god, we're going to have so much money, we're not going to know what to do with it. It's like my missus, she hasn't upgraded any of her guns because she hasn't felt the need to. And she's got so much money in this game. Photo of a strange bird. Oh! That's a little hint for the um, bluebird that we got earlier. Very interesting. Ooh. Oh my god, how cool is that? Okay. Explosive rounds. So, November 10th. Mistress Donna is now Mother Miranda's adopted daughter. In all my years, I've never been this overjoyed. Ever since childhood, she has always feared others due to the scar across her face. After her parents' death, she locked herself away and would only talk to Angie, the doll her father made her. I am forever thankful to Mother Miranda's uh, infinite compassion. November 27th. Mistress Donna seems happy. It might be my imagination, but I feel like her doll Angie is even more lively than before. She came to me in the garden today and used Angie to talk to me. We had a mighty fine conversation. Something about her receiving a gift of power from Mother. November 29th. Mistress Donna gave me a yellow flower and told me to plant them in the garden. I planted them in front of Mistress Claudia's grave. I don't know if it was the scent of the flowers, but I felt light-headed. Then, like a dream, I saw my departed wife. I mentioned this to Donna and she seemed thrilled by it. She told me to go to the house tomorrow and see her. She said I could see my family once more. Oof. I'm not sure what she meant by that. She's so kind. Oh. Ah, oh, there's Luthar's key. Okay. Ah, oh, we've got so much exploring to do. Right, this game is freaking fantastic. So we've. Okay. Oh. Alright, this is going to be a bit of a bugger. But it's okay. These are really cool, to be honest. I bet they're going to get fairly devious, though. Come on. I was expecting it to be significantly more uh, intricate than the last one. 
Come on. The physics are a little bit wonky, but that's okay. Right. Oof. Oof. Come on. Kill some of that energy. Kill some of that energy. Oh, my. Okay. That was... Onyx Skull. That was really bloody easy. Surprisingly easy. So, flowers that are making people dream. Hmm. Strange stuff indeed. Did we miss this somehow on the way here? I mean, we must have done. Yeah. I don't know how we missed that area on the way here, but... Ah. Hang on. We've missed a well. We're going to have to go back and get that well. So, oh, yeah, of course, because we couldn't get that well. Okay, we can do that. That's fine. All right, let's get back. Still haven't heard any anything. Yeah, we got these winged assholes. Oh, I was gonna say there had to be one, surely. Right, let's take this slow. Hey, friend. Let's take this slow. Don't you go waving your wheezy breath at me, dude. I bet your breath smells like farts. Oh. This is different. Large crystal. Don't mind if I do. Come on. Let's have, let's be having ya. Let's be having ya. Okay. That large crystal wasn't there before, was it? Was it? Right, I don't want to skip out any of the path just in case there's more enemies along here. Because we need to kill them all. We will cleanse this land. Oh, hello. Come on, dude. I need your loot. I need your money. Uncle Titan's got uh, bills to pay. We got big bills. Oh! Is there like crystals and stuff on most of these graves? Really? Alright. I mean, they're worth examining at the very least. Big sack of cash. Come on, dude. Up you come. Not even going to get out of the fucking ground, mate. Might have to make some more handgun bullets. But again, that can be solved. That can be sorted. Right. Hello, Duke, my friend. Now, before... We go see the Duke. Let's go this way. And let's go rob the well. Because I'm guessing there's something juicy down there. I mean, maybe not. It might just be some ammo or something, but it's definitely worth checking. I mean, I'm guessing we can go back. I can't see why we wouldn't be able to. I need to check all of these as well. Like, I get the feeling there's... 
Yeah, we're probably not going to get all of the uh, goats, but that's fine. Oh, can we not go back? Seriously? Um, yeah, we check that journal out before we end the video. Uh, oh, that's frustrating. But the thing is, ah, look, suspension bridge. Right, uh, yeah, I'm guessing there's another way to get back there because we didn't have the well wheel when we were there. Okay, okay. All right, uh, sure. All right, in that case, let's go see the Duke. Let's go make some transactions, make some sales. And we can't get into this water, can we? We can't go... See, there's a boat there. Alright. Now, I'm pretty sure I'm going to sell our shotgun and we're going to use the new one. Just because I want to use the new one. I want to experience the new shotgun. Does this look familiar oh. to you? <laughs> you little fucker. <laughs> I've gotten some new stock. Yeah, I've heard that before, Duke. Uh, right, let's Finished. just double check. Right, so it's only the necklace with two holes. Are you all oh, good? I was just thinking of ways to pass the time. Well, you can give me some money. I procured some new items for you, Mr. Winters. Thank you. I guess we could have used the shotgun. If we're going to sell it. Whoa, my dude. Whoa. 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 Um, let's do it. There we go. A hundred thousand. Yeah, because that's worth more money. Ah, we can actually compare it better here. And the thing is, not only is that a better weapon, we can upgrade it more as well. So, okay, reload speed. Yeah, I mean, it's better in every way, really, apart from ammo capacity, which I'm sure we can, you know, sort that in time. So, I mean, the rifle, is there any point in upgrading it? Because we're definitely going to get better weapons. There's no doubt about it. Okay. Ah, Miss Angie. Just adorable. Porcelain dolls are very popular, you know. Well, I'm happy for you. Um, so, gunsmithery. Oof. Yeah. Right, what have you got for me? We can produce explosive and flashbangs. Okay. Uh, improved grip greatly reduces recoil and for the shotgun see these things I think are probably worth it because you don't really seem to lose that much money <laughs> nice because you get the majority of your money back when you sell the weapon. So it's worth it. And we've got so much money anyway. Like, we don't even know what to do with this money. Uh, I mean, I guess we could just buy these because why not? And in fact, 
Yeah, we might as well. Let's just buy some handgun bullets. Yeah, that's a little bit more expensive, but... We're not breaking the bank. We're not breaking the bank. So, damage and capacity, I'm thinking. Okay. All right. Good stuff. Have a wonderful adventure. Oh, thank you. I think we will. I think we will. Uh, so we've got more shotgun shells. We've got five pipe bombs. We've got six pipe bombs. Magnum ammo as well. Got plenty of health. It's a shame we can't upgrade our knife. But then, who knows? Maybe we can later on. Alright, let's put the food down here. That's one problem with the food. It takes up inventory space. Okay. Alright. Not bad. And with that, guys, we are finished. So, when we return... We're going to continue exploring, I think. Although, oh, look, we can go down here now and open that door. Oh, <laughs> well, this is going to be the last video for me today. Um, but we should be able... Oh, God, hang on. we're gonna. It says something about getting a new weapon down there, doesn't it? Yeah, water will weapon. Oh god, I wonder what that could be. I hope it's not like an... It might be a new rifle, actually. Or it might be something entirely different. Who knows? Anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching. And as always, till next time.